Good morning, good afternoon and good evening to all Denarians on the go and in the know. Like subscribe, and share with your fellow Denarian friends. If you have not done so yet, pick up your free trial copy of the Currency Exchange Planner and check out the awesome new Currency Exchange Planner Companion, voted the number one exchange planner in the Denar community for a reason. The link is in the description box below this video. Lock in your copy today. Everyone, this has been a long ride for most of us, and I truly believe we are nearing the end. I am about 99% convinced that this world event is unfolding before our eyes using the coronavirus as a cover. I googled how many people die each year in the average flu season, the result was 56,000 worldwide. Today's coronavirus has only killed around 3,200, but yet the media is making a huge deal of this thing all of a sudden as the economies collapse. I do not believe in coincidences. They did not even make such a big deal out of the HIV virus which is still killing people to this day. I may be wrong but, there is way too much hype being produced around this, and if there is one thing I have learned from being in the military, it is always look at the government's left hand when they are telling the citizen to look at the right. With that being said, let's get started. First article of interest for today. The Association of Private Banks concludes the Banking Cards and Electronic Services course. The Iraqi Private Banking Association concluded, Thursday, the cycle of bank cards and electronic banking services, with the participation of a number of government and private banks. The session was held in cooperation between the Association of Iraqi Private Banks and the Center for Banking Studies at the Central Bank of Iraq and a group of joint efforts. The course aimed to strengthen the mechanism in the work of each technology in electronic payment and the role of customer service in light of the competitive environment. Before I read this next one, keep in mind China has been collecting and destroying their paper cash for weeks now, and I do believe we will be doing this here in the USA as well, in order to force mass adoption into the CBDC, Central Bank Digital Currency, World of the Future. The central bank issues a decision to change its financial dealings to avoid corona. The central bank issued a decision today, Thursday, to change its financial dealings to avoid the spread of the coronavirus through securities. The bank said in a statement, received by Alfred News a copy of it, that it was in line with what our dear country is going through, and as a result of the Central Bank of Iraq's follow-up to international reports that warn of the ability of banknotes to be a carrier medium for viruses. He added, the bank invites merchants and citizens to deal with electronic payment tools, cards, points of sale, mobile wallets, and avoid dealing with cash in order to preserve public health. Next article of interest. To prevent corona. This is the advice of the central bank to deal with money. The central bank of Iraq called, on Thursday, merchants and citizens to avoid dealing in cash payment as much as possible to prevent the emerging coronavirus. The bank said in a statement received by Shafiq News, we coincided with what our dear country is going through, and as a result of the Central Bank of Iraq following up on international reports that warn of the ability of banknotes to be a carrier medium for viruses. The bank called on merchants and citizens to deal with electronic payment tools, cards, points of sale, mobile wallets, and avoid dealing in cash for the sake of public health. Iraq recorded three deaths from coronavirus infections two in Baghdad and one in Suleymaniyah, out of a total of 38 recorded infections. The injuries are distributed as follows. 14 Baghdad, 8 Suleymaniyah, 5 Kirkuk, 4 Najaf, 2 Wasit, 2 Diala, 1 Mason, 1 Karbala and 1 Babel. Next article of interest. The central bank demands citizens to stop dealing in banknotes. The Central Bank of Iraq today called on citizens to stop dealing in bank notes to prevent the transfer of corona, where officials called the Central Bank to refrain as much as possible from dealing in bank notes in order to guard against the coronavirus and called for dealing with electronic payment. Next article of interest. Iraq stresses the need to reach an agreement that will achieve balance and stability in global markets. 
Iraq stressed the need to reach an agreement between members of the oil exporting countries, OPEC, and those allied with them from outside the organization, aiming to achieve stability and restore the balance between supply and demand, and work to alleviate the effects and repercussions that followed the spread of coronavirus. The head of the Iraqi delegation, Under Secretary Hamid Yunus, during his participation in the ministerial meeting, 178, of members of the oil exporting countries, OPEC, in Vienna, that everyone is aware of the repercussions of the coronavirus crisis and the vibrations that hit the oil market as a result, and their direct impact on the decline in demand for crude oil, especially by China, which is the second largest global economy and this requires in-depth research on the implications for the global markets in the short and medium term, and take appropriate steps by producers, stressing that the Asian market is important for us and others, as a promising market for crude oil and index economic growth. The head of the participating delegation continued. We have confidence that these countries will overcome the crisis and control it during the coming period and return to economic activity more than it was before the emergence of corona. Yanis added that he met a number of oil and energy ministers in the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, the Islamic Republic of Iran, Algeria, and the United Arab Emirates, as well as the Secretary General of the Organization of the Petroleum Exporting Countries Mohamed Barakindo and discussed with them the importance of reaching an agreement that contributes to achieving the goals of the producers and is a joint and joint responsibility in order to maintain the balance and stability of the oil markets. Stressing the exceptional efforts of the Iraqi delegation in bringing views closer to a suitable agreement that restores global economic activity and increases the demand for crude oil. For his part, Director General of the Iraqi Oil Marketing Company, SOMO, Al Al Yasiri said that the Joint Technical Committee, JTC, met on Tuesday. Its recommendations were submitted to the OPEC ministerial meeting, which was held Thursday, and to the ministerial meeting of the organization and its allies held on Friday. After reviewing the reports prepared by the OPEC Research Center regarding the effects of the virus on the demand for crude oil in the oil market and its implications for Chinese and global economic growth, the ministry spokesman, Asim Jihad, affirmed that the producers in OPEC and those allied to it face great difficulties towards this crisis, which directly affected the Chinese economy and undermined its imports of crude and reduced the volume of economic growth in general even if it was for a limited period. Jihad added on the continuation of the ministerial meeting of the Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries, OPEC, on Thursday. Then, tomorrow, the ministerial meeting of the Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries and its allies will resume tomorrow. Everyone hopes to succeed in reaching a new agreement that will contribute to the stability of the oil market. The oil market from collapse and played a wise role in bringing views closer to previous meetings, and despite all that, Iraq was and still supports strongly all the agreements that aim to achieve the required balance between supply and demand and lead to the stability of global markets. Hit the like and subscribe button to be alerted as more articles of interest are posted. Check out the Denarian blog, Facebook and Twitter for all of today's articles of interest. Pick up your free trial copy of the newly upgraded Currency Exchange Planner and check out the new Currency Exchange Planner companion before you leave. Use the promo code, the Denarian, and get 25% off at checkout when you decide to unleash the full planner's abilities, along with the mobile application added free for being my subscriber. Register today as an affiliate with the Gold Savings Carrot Bar program. If you do not keep your savings in a real asset like gold, You risk everything as the fiat system fails and they boot up the new quantum financial system on the blockchain. Protect your family's wealth today in physical gold, as tomorrow may be too late. The program is made so everyone can afford to save in gold, by offering it one gram at a time. Start saving in a real true asset like gold, it's free to register and secure your family's savings tomorrow. Why do you think all the central banks are loading up on gold lately, and running from the current depreciating fiat US dollar? Do you think they do not know what is coming? Get yourself protected. 
Both of the links to these invaluable programs are available in the description box below this video. Go check them out. Knowledge is power. Using that newfound knowledge is powerful. Over and out, for now, the Denarian.